замом. На физике. of those girls has he murdered so far? Sixty-two. Sixty-two? Someone has to stop him. Can't you do something about it? I don't know what you're so worried about. You have no daughters here in bed. Don't be cynical. I know you, and you'd never go over to the other side. So what are you trying to say? The worst is yet to come. I agree, our caliph is a maniac and a menace to the girls of Baghdad. But what would happen to our country if the vizier were... The vizier could have seized the throne a long time ago if that were his plan. No, the man's not strong enough yet. But to get there, he'll help the caliph with his insane acts. You know the caliph rewarded him for his idea with the Sultanate of Basora, another of his clever ideas, and farewell to you, Ermir Serimbid, to the five sons and the palace. But what do you mean? What new idea? A law reforming the execution of criminals. No more gallows, but the pole. The pole? Yes, a long, rounded, sharpened stick, which is forced into the victim's... Oh, well, uh, look. May Allah curse the caliph. May he also curse the vizier. May he... Do you suppose he heard? he won't talk. How can you be so sure? Because I know that the vizier has had his tongue oh. cut off. What can we do, Asam? Only Allah can guide us. Allah, Yemen Allah! Oh, great prophet, give us inspiration. Hassam, how many days to go yet? You can stop counting now, Sinbad. Look carefully, over there. But I don't see anything. Look, over there, starboard. back to Baghdad and take possession of your properties. But I don't understand why you hate to see so much. How can I? And now, what will you do? You won't believe this, but I'll go on traveling around the world, but only on camelback. 
<laughs> I'll buy a palace with beautiful gardens. I'll want slaves. Many slaves as beautiful as yours. I'll want a harem. Wonderful as the garden of the great Prophet Allah. Very clever. And when you spend all your money, you'll come back and be a sailor again. <laughs> Yes, but meanwhile, I'll enjoy myself. In Baghdad! Look! Why, that's Sinbad! Ivory inlaid? Who knows if it's really of ivory? Oh, I would say so. I wasn't talking to you. Write this down. I write. 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 With presumed? So, uh, with presumed? Inlaid. Inlaid. Ivory. A Turkish pipe of worthless metal. But it's gold. We have to carry out orders. Write down. Of worthless metal. Well, whose orders and why? What are you doing in my house? Ah, Simba, you have just come back at the right time. Like this, I can give you what is due to you. Unfortunately, I have to inform you that your foster mother is dead. Ah, Zaira. Yes, and here, take this. And that's all what, that is what, left for what? you. Leave us now, go. Have you written it? No, what? Where was I? Ah, yes, of worthless metal. You will find the other half of this message in the large safe. Hmm. Tell me, where is the large safe? Persia is full of safes, large and small. What is this? How should I know? I didn't write it. But well, there is nothing else in here. I gave it to you just as I found it, sailor. Oh, yeah? What are you insinuating? I am the caddy, a magistrate of the caliph. What about the rest? The house and the furniture? The horses, the money? Zaira was heavily in debt and behind with her taxes. Thus, the vizier ordered the confiscation of this house and its contents. And now, where do I sleep? In jail, if you don't get out of here immediately. Oh, no, you don't frighten me. I want the evidence. Show me the documents. No, what are you doing? Leave me alone. Go on. Leave me go. Let me alone. Get your hands off me. That'll be enough. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Uh. in jail? No. Throw him out. Come on. Ah. Let me go, damn you. The vizier is going to hear about this. Uh, that's the one he already knows. Then I'll go to the caliph. Better still. You're doing better, my boy. <laughs> Oh, I'll find someone here in Baghdad. Oh, I am out. It's not going to end up like this. You'll pay for it. Uh. 
Stop being foolish and get wise, or you'll be very sorry for yourself. You know what the pole is? The pole? You better find out before you come back and see us. You better weigh anchor, sailor. Uh. Syrian. Egyptian. I'm not a foreigner. I'm not. Uh, uh, yes, but you have an accent, isn't it? Uh... Have your own accent and leave me alone. You don't know your way around a city. I can uh, tell. What you... Terribly treacherous streets that take you who knows where. Big pockets. Hundreds of big pockets. And assassins. Ooh, big throats and cut pockets. Well, nothing much in here. Ooh. Uh, you're hungry out there, huh? Hungry, I bet you don't even know the meaning of the word. Hmm? Oh, no, no, no. no. But just to keep you company, we'll take you to a place where you can eat like a pasha. And sleep like a sultan. Is it far? No, it's not a good spot. Two steps from here. Oh, just, just behind the building. building. Huh? Oh. Oh, just a minute. Who's that one? <laughs> He's the owner of the place. Come on, let's go. Oops. But this is not an eating place. Wait and see. <laughs> I'm afraid my picture won't nearly be enough. <laughs> The Christians have wine, but we have something that's better. Extract of coconut and banana. Yeah. Try it. Yeah, you always say you should always try everything at once. Yes, what do you think of it? I think among other things it makes you hungry. <laughs> hey, give me some of that, oh, will no, you? No, no, no. Just as soon as I finish work, I will. <laughs> like an angel from paradise. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. 
14. Fourteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Ah. Mm. Ah. 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 Ah.
hopes are fading. I lost my half of the parchment. And I don't even know where the big safe is. Side and swab that deck and don't lift your head. Don't so lay on load is done. The merchandise is here, Sonny. I have my five piastres. I said three. Oh, no, Bosai. I cannot do it for less than Just four. Three. All right. Thank you. Right under there. No. Rose mm. tint in a thin gold chain. Round her ankle. Oh! You know what I think? I'd be better appreciated somewhere else. Ah! As I said, a thin gold chain on her ankle. 
A mischief even women use seawater, see? But not him. He has to use fresh water. All I know is if my other takes a level of the tank, we'll all be food for fish. Yeah. How do you use it for? Sure, chicken noodle soup. Exactly. <laughs> but we, we don't, don't care. care. We, we don't, don't like chicken, chicken noodle, noodle soup. soup. But, you know, we'll all be sunk if you don't change ideas. But I won't change ideas. No. You're worse than a mule. Yes, as bad as in a stubborn. Don't insist, understand? I'll do as I've decided. <laughs> And I want to be perfumed. Oh, perfumed? Yes, covered, anointed, and rubbed with perfume. Yeah, oh. a lot of good it'll do us if I catch you at it. Gee whiz. Perfume, perfume. No, this one too. No, this, this. Hmm. Oh, this one smells good. What is it? <laughs> it's a chicken lily. Yes, this'll do. Where are you, you lout? Who's the baby the eunuch? Who? Oh, hide. Crazy. Oh. Hurry. Put your head down. Keep your head down. Hey, you gallows bird. What's happened to British Harris Art? Dinner, huh? Well, I. Uh, well? Well, I. Uh, Is it ready? Well, uh, yes, I was just going to start preparing the help. No! Stupid negligence! Your negligence. How can you justify yourself in my eyes? Most potent sire. You told me you appreciated my cooking. Hmm. I want to die, I cook specially for you, mighty one. Ah, what have you in mind? Is it caviar, swallow's nest? No, no. Spaghetti and meatball. Spaghetti and meatball. Oh. Mm, I want to taste it. Hey. Uh, oh, look at that. Now I'm all dirty and smelly. Ooh, I'll need rivers of heliotrope. Oh, all I want to give me these trials. I'll have you both whipped. Eight lashes each, which will become 16. If the princess's dinner is not ready for her in one minute. And my sleeping potion as well. Ah. <laughs> He's gone. What potion did he mean? Oh, your cameraman in Linden. Over there. He suffers from insomnia, huh? Hmm. <laughs> Opium? Ashes. So he doesn't sleep, huh? I'll take care of that. Huh? Oh, no! No, no you can't do that. Oh, but our dead bodies! Oh. You two oh. put me in this mess in the first place. And I've decided to go to the bottom of things. Don't try to oh. stop me! Oh. he looked at me as though he were not a common slave. Well, you see, slaves are men, too. So dirty. Tried to think of him right after his bath and all dressed in silk. Come in. Princess's supper. Ah, a lovely volunteer. Your portion is here, too. Uh, put it down. Where? Oh, here, there. Better there than here. That way it'll cool before I have to take it. It's rather awful. But it's good for you. Here, drink it. You big bad boy. You have such convincing ways. Sit down. <laughs> la, 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 la. Oh, no, you told me I'm convincing, so you must obey me. Here, drink it. <laughs> Want some? You say it's awful. That's right. Don't be a test of your friendship. I don't suffer from insomnia. You don't get the point. Oh, all right, but I'll drink after you. Someone knocked. I don't think so. Go on, drink. Who is it? The princess asked for you. Oh, tell her I'll be right there in a minute. Oh, these females, huh? Uh. Uh. The name 
Maybe the princess is angry. Why are you so late? She's tired and hungry. She wants to eat and go to sleep. You should keep her waiting like that. She takes it out on out. Now get out of my way. We got out of his mind. Hats like him are strange. What happened? Why are you so late, Zenebi? Zenebi is ill. And I have taken his place. <gasps> Something wrong, princess. Well, no. I mean, I didn't know about you. I don't know you. Are you sure? And yet... I've never seen you before. And these tasks are usually entrusted to women. Fear not. Who... Oh, I understand. You like the Navy. No, but uh, I can control the emotions aroused by a splendid creature like you. I won't need this anymore. What do you mean? Oh, nothing. It has served its purpose. It got me near you. May I? Yes, but first pass me that shawl. <gasps> you are the one who was washing the deck. That's right. But why didn't you tell me immediately? I tried, but you said, uh, I don't know you, I've never seen you before. If you happen to be the one who is in command, then listen carefully to the supplicant. And be patient with him until he has finished to put his plea to you. A well-conducted conversation livens the heart. Partego, Pharaoh of Egypt. How do you know these things? I was taught how to translate the hieroglyphics, the ideograms of Chinese and the dialects of India. But why? What for? Could you tell me? Aren't you afraid I'll bore you? This is the most interesting thing that's happened to me on this whole dull trip. Do you mind? Oh, that's why I'm here. What a coincidence. Officially, I mean. Tell me, who are you? That's what I would like to know, too. How do you mean? Very simple. I never knew my father, nor I knew my mother. But who brought you up? A foster mother. She educated me to be a prince, but, well, I became a sailor. Oh, there must have been a reason. And a pretty good one. Probably there was a good reason. So far, I haven't discovered it yet. Why isn't he coming back? Oh, if something had gone wrong, we'd have certainly known by this time. Yeah, but Zinnaby will be waking up any moment now. No, not a bit of it. With that sleeping potion. <laughs> we should do something. Let's go call him. But what if we meet Abu? Or Barky? Or Bajaza? <laughs> <laughs> so after they sold you, then they were sold themselves? Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just can't stop. Try to understand my situation. A slave on board his ship. <laughs> We're all slaves, including Sherazade, Crown Princess of Bahrain. You? Yes, because my father, the Sultan, chose to dispose of my future before he died. So I'm going far away from my homeland to marry a man that I don't know. Exactly what you're thinking of. Run away? Yes, of course. No more slavery. Free. No more worries about being married to a man you've never known. But only... Continue. But only? But only you. You and I. I don't know the man that I have to marry. But I know who he is. Sharia. Caliph of all Persia. <laughs> If we had no other reason to flee, this would be enough. But it's madness. Not if we plan things carefully. Listen, Sinbad. You yourself told me that by order of the Caliph... I no longer possess anything. And even if we were able to escape, we'd be living forever in the fear of being caught, and the misery, the poverty. Well, I'll find some work somewhere. You only know how to be a sailor. Our love would be enough to overcome anything. I will marry Shadia. I've been taught from childhood not to confuse matters of life, realities, with fantasies. 
They say two people in love can overcome anything, but I don't believe it. Not only a minute ago. Yes, it was just a moment of weakness. That revealed many things. But not enough to ruin my whole future. But Shazad, you... Stop there. Shazad. Stay where you are. I don't think... Beware, Sinbad. The alarm! What's happening? Quickly! The alarm! He got in here by trickery. He was dressed up as the Navy. Oh, he put opium in my sleeping potion. Or maybe he put hashish. I don't know, but he did. Did he put his hands on you? He didn't dare to. And I didn't give him time. I will say nothing. If you do the same as I do, it will be better for both of us. The Caliph must not know. Purpose. The Navy suffers from insomnia. With a little opium, we thought he'd uh, sleep much better. That's right. It's you who are in charge of the drugs. <laughs> That's right. That's fine. Fine for the fish, that is. They'll eat three times as much. Come on. Oh. Ah, spaghetti with meatballs, huh? Ah. <gasps> this time, instead of making a fish meal, you'll make a meal for a fish. <laughs> All right, get on with it. Stop! Hold it. Saadi, spare their lives. Due to the gracious intervention of the Princess Saharazad, your lives are spared. Water for a week, and never long ends. All of them. You two, get in the lifeboat. Uh, couldn't we go and help out below decks? It would be fine. Mm -hmm. All right, just you. But hurry. <laughs> I'm thirsty. Give me that skin. Damn it! It's seawater. We're in a mess. No, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. Just a moment. What is that? You remember when Saudi said I could go and help out below decks? Well, I included some of his personal things. Things meant for Zenobia, Francis. <laughs> Not bad. Tastes like tea. 
Yeah, so it is. He made it. <laughs> well, we better get moving if we want to reach the coast. Uh -huh. Let me get over there. Uh, ready? Yes, I'm ready. Uh, oh. Oh, keep the water in the ocean. That's where it belongs. And row. In rhythm. In rhythm. Like this. I like this. Oh. Oh. oh! oh! See what technique means. But we're not following the ship. Of course not. They're going north and we're going west to the nearest land. What land is that? The peninsula of Qatar. How far is that, eh? Not too far. We'll take ships so we can save our energies. We'll make it, you'll see. Don't worry. Papa, papa, papa. When we get back to Baghdad, boy, am I going to make the owner of that tavern feel sorry for himself. He and his gorillas. And, oh, boy, am I going to enjoy myself. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> now I want to get even with that Enoch. He's bigger than me, yeah. And so I'm going to take him unawares. Yeah, unawares. <laughs> you? Don't you want to get even with anybody, Sinbad? Barman, that's the order for the other side. Quick! All right, just a minute. Hold on. Do you always have to do everything wrong? Stop All splashing! Right. Now, come on, will you get to work? All please? right, all right. Come on, then. Are all you right. ready? All right. Cut that roof and cast that farmer. You can take two all right. to change it all. Keep to the left. Oh. Now, pull. Oh. 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 Pull harder, harder. There it is. Nothing we can do now. Uh... Oh, Fred, I don't see anything. Nor me. Hey! Uh, we're finishing the deadly current of Oman. Where is it going to take us? Uh, nobody can tell. Those who were taken never return. Hmm. And I'll use rowing now. I'm tired. I want to sleep. Try not to disturb me, huh? You know what I say. Who the hell cares? What was that? A sudden wave. But the sea is calm. Oh, we've hit a whale. Or a mast of a sunken ship. Listen to him trying to be funny. Why don't you try to keep quiet and go to sleep? I spent two years sailing on it. to the ships. Us too. I cut it out. I've never been in such a small island before. <laughs> this is an Egyptian war boat. The crew was former prisoners chained to the benches. Hey. understand why I don't like the sea. Yeah. Ah! 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 Oh, it's 
striking iron. Maybe he was trying to light something before he died. Huh? But... Perez! Come! But Perez! What? Oh, look at this beautiful cloth. Where is, where is? Oh, yes, yes. Where is it? It's a Smell it. Isn't it wonderful? Look, look, look. Let's see what's inside. Oh, how wonderful. Ha-ha! It's all ours. It's all ours. Ha-ha! But there's not even one headache. Why do you worry? We're surrounded by the ocean and it's full of fish. We'll survive, you see. Uh, but then why didn't the other ones survive, then? Maybe they didn't like eating fish. Uh. What happened? You're all wet. Of course, this is your bus. Another one? Yeah. But you had one on both ship. You're a maniac for cleanliness. <laughs> you wind up with rheumatism. Look what we found. Uh, Look. Did you find it in a Chinese ship? Chinese? The one with the dragon tent. Yes. Seen them before. Oh, I've been to China. Where they make them? What are they for? Have you got a flint? Yes. Come. Come with me. Here. Light the end of the tape. But will you explain? Come on, let's get out of here now. But huh? what? Come on, hurry up. I really don't understand the reason for all this rush. Will you come over, as I say? Perus, if he tells you... Down! Perus! Oh. Perus, are you all right? I'm gonna sit down. <laughs> <laughs> It will then fill up the balloon and... Uh, here's a word I can't translate. It's no use, Sinbad. We've looked all over everywhere. And there's nothing growing around here. No sign of fresh water. And no rain. And with all our lines out, we haven't even caught a sardine yet. And you've been looking on the seabed. And haven't even found a mussel. Nor a we. Why did you tell him? He's no longer afraid. He's prepared to die. And so? Well, so, that's his what's left. Then? Then what? And then we'll tell you what the two of us have decided to do to get out of this situation. And if you wish, you may come with us. Oh. Watch your step. Ooh. Ooh. You know what this is? It's ashes. If you take some, you dream. And you feel wonderful. Yes, but then you open your eyes again. But if you take a little more, you don't wake up. You sleep forever and ever. From sleep into death without ever knowing it. Isn't that beautiful? 
No, but there's a solution. He could work. Will it? I'll do it. Bravo. Relax. First of all, you must make a wish. Something you've always wanted very badly to have. And then you'll find it'll seem to come true. I wish. I wish. I could see Sherazad. So beautiful. And so merciless. I wish I could tell her about our dad. See her wounded and humiliated. If I could only fly. Uh, if I could reach back dad. See that we too are rising. That's the meaning of the Chinese word, to ascend. The hot air goes upwards. And if one could enclose it and then keep the temperature constant, the balloon will go up. Get out of there now. That's what he wanted to light. What should we do now? We must get all the shells and all the rockets. What do we want to do that for? We take them with us on board a ship. Come on. Oh. Oh. We don't have to leave the treasure here, do we? Go take it. Running. Uh oh. Enough wood for the fire? Yes, is that everything? Oh, that. Oh, no. Come on. Uh, that. Here, Sambad. Thank you. Are you ready? Oh, yes, of course. Uh, All right. Oh, oh, oh. Sit down oh, oh, and keep quiet. Oh, oh. Look, we're going up. Oh, oh. oh my, my goodness. Oh, oh. oh. said Ostro. Ostro? It's the wind from the south. It blows in the right direction and pushes up to the north. Oh, Ostro. It will be only a few points off. Can't you stop being lazy and get up? We gotta keep the fire going. Oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Up here? 
Did you light the fuse? Yeah, I did. Go get Shadazad. Okay, sure. Look up too. The princess was left in Baghdad. She's not aboard anymore. Get out of the way. Hmm. Now let's see. Abu, Baki, come here. You are two formidable fighters, aren't you? Especially when you're ganging up against one. Well, now you'll have an even chance. You'll be one against one. Who is to be the first? Emomi. No, no. You don't understand. You'll be fighting each other. And you better win. Because the loser is going to be blown up by this. <laughs> <laughs> A real clean fight. Bravo. <laughs> against Balki. Uh -huh. And try to win if you want to avoid this. I've changed my mind. The winner will die. Oh, no, Stephen. You can't do that. All of the board. For once in his life, Saudi spoke the truth. There's nobody below deck. Where is everybody? Return aboard! Sadi! Come here! <laughs> the ring! Oh, the necklace! The necklace! <laughs> <laughs> we can go now! Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you take it off my belonging. Oh. We have the right wind. We have the northwest. <laughs> Noble is here. I bring great news to the Caliph. The royal troops have won their way to the west coast of Bengala. The enemy army has surrendered and the population is waiting for the Sultan designate from Baghdad. Kasim, my proud warrior, I will immediately inform our noble sovereign. Immediately? But His Highness gave orders not to be disturbed. But we bring him news of a great and tremendous victory. He will listen. I didn't ask you to come in. Get out. But, sire, the reason for which I... Get out! He 
You must convoke all the sultans. We'll tell them of his insane behavior. Persia must be guided by a more suitable ruler. Well, what do you mean? The next sultan of Bengala will be you. Uh. Yes. Yes. And now the other side. What is your name? Sherazad, my father. Silent! I didn't ask you about your father. The rest. Turn around. Turn around, I say! Slowly. There is one thing that you must learn. You will move and talk only when I order you to. Is that clear? Can you dance? Yes. Which dances? All of them. Chinese, Indian, Egyptian. Take her to the harem and see that she's always ready for me to dance at any time I choose. Now to the bazaar, incognito, for the new arrival. <laughs> you know what I've been thinking? Taking a bath is not the most terrible thing I thought it was. I mean, feeling of hot water on your skin. What hot water? It was hot steam. <laughs> uh, steam's made with water. In any case, you know I love it. Cleanliness is next to wealthiness. Oh, right. Hey! And we're wealthy! Yes. <laughs> Massage? Shave? Corn? Everything! Everything. Right? Come this way, please. <laughs> <laughs> Shave my beard. You mean a trim? No, 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 no. I want to be clean. Take away from the nobles. Ask them and the assembly. You want to make yourself really beautiful. Ah. <laughs> I'm worried, Asim. Very, very worried indeed. And you, have you no respect for the nobility? The resemblance is incredible. Two leaves from the same branch. If only he didn't have that beard. Shaving your beard? Yes, why? When you're finished, wait for us. We want to speak with you. I simply don't believe it, Ken. Here, quick. A Caucasian woman, so they say, is something no home should be without. Goodbye. Don't exaggerate, ladies and gentlemen, don't have to. You see, this is an article that sells itself. But stars observe, this beauty is as talented as she is beautiful. She's trained in poetry, in painting, and she knows all the dances, and schooled in the subtlest arts of love. Do I hear a bid? I offer 3,000. 3,200. I offer 3,500. I'm not telling you she knows how to cook, <laughs> because she doesn't. She has other talent. 3,600 dinars! 3,800! 4,000! Come, come, sir. This is a vile price for so heavenly a creature. Why, she would fetch 10,000 dinars even in so lonely a place as Basora. 4,600! 4,700! 5,000! 5,500! Go on, please, noble sirs. Now the bids are becoming interesting. 5,600! 6,000! 6,500. 6,510. Sold! Uh, this is not fair. He outbeats us by only 10 dinners and walks away with the merchandise. This is the usual swindle. Noble sir, please, I assure you. I shall have recourse to the caliph. You know him? I don't need to know him, sir, to get the justice. Whoa! <laughs> huh? That's enough, that's enough now, noble sir. The deal is settled. Settled, is it? We'll see. This is for you. Uh, very good, lad. And you, very you almost slit my throat if I hadn't. <laughs> what, sir? Very good One, shave indeed. <laughs> two.
Keep the servant, Barman. Once more, we've already done it. Don't get rich. Come on, let's go. We were to speak to you, remember? That's why I'm leaving. I had too much to do with men like you. Too much and enough. No, wait. Explain to him. To the bazaar! The bazaar! <laughs> to the bazaar! To the bazaar! To the bazaar! <laughs> Gaze upon this miracle, sirs, freshly arrived from the Bowley Bank of the Persian Gulf. Must I let this beauty go for a pound for 8,000 dinars, not half a true value? What am I bid? Pictures recall those of the Egyptian goddess, her skin is soft as silk. Noble sirs, are none of you attracted by this fragrance of the salt sea? Or could it be you're all a little hard of hearing, perhaps? Come now, what am I offered? Gentlemen, 7,800, 7,900, going, 8,000, going, going, no other bids, huh? That does Sold! No, this one you will not take away from me. 15,000. 15,000, 15,000, do I hear more? 15,000. Sold! Oh! <laughs> oh! Let me go! What are you doing? Let me go! Let me go! Sinbad! Oh, Sinbad! 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 This is the last. It has to be. We're nearing the end. You stay here and guard him while he's out. Change over when you want. No one but those of us here must know what medicine he's been given. No one. Let's go. It's worked so far. Yes, but where's the Caliph now? At the Inn of the Rising Sun. They're staying there. I've talked to the owner of the bath. And those two imbeciles think that he is still their friend. Go now. To the Inn. Yes, of course, you know what you must do. But don't be afraid. It's too late to turn back now. But Sinbad, will he cooperate? That, of course, I can't say. But whatever happens, he's in it, too. Up, two, up, two, hard! Up, two! and they made me swallow something. And then I lost consciousness. You made me smell something foul, and I find myself in a straitjacket. What is it, a madhouse? What do you want from me? I wanted to explain it to you at the baths. Explain what? You see, you look like someone. Or someone looks like you. Is that why you put a straitjacket on me? Don't you want to know who you look like? Oh, all right, tell me. Here, smell this oh. once more before I tell you. Mm -hmm. You first, oh, beggars, oh, oh, wretches! This be got the cellar! You let me out, or I swear! Where did all your super strength go? Uh, uh, you know who I am. We know, but it seems as though you were forgotten then. Your ideas are confused. Now listen, Sinbad. Calm down. And you'll see that. Hey, left. Huh? Finally! 
about time. Have you got a guard with you? I want their heads cut off immediately. No, my lord, the entire city is in revolt. And you must be grateful to these two gentlemen who saved you from the hands of a very nasty crowd. It would be terribly foolhardy to leave the inn at this point, sire. But why is the city in revolt? The people are made that way. They say that you can't rule, that you're wastefully spending the country's money. One shouldn't give them a chance to raise their heads, but cut them off as soon as they do. Yes, I'll cut everybody's head off. Indeed, as soon as things calm down. Here, take this. It's your potion. Drink it, and when you awaken, all will be over, and you will wield the scimitar of revenge. Yes, I'll get my revenge. Did you bring a scimitar and a bow? Oh. I haven't yet decided if I want to play your game. I won't do it to save Persia, I tell you. Uh, but only because... Because Sherizad is here. It's the third time you're repeating it. But well, think of the risk. Think of the reward. Yes. Yes, this could be the answer to everything. If I could only put my hands on the other half of it, and on the large safe. There's only one large safe, the one of the caliph. But the keys are kept by the vizier, and they're going to be hard to get. No vizier and no keys. It will be enough to use the services of Bahman and Firuz. Those two? I guarantee it. Now show me the palace. If I am to substitute the caliph, I think I should know the layout of the place. Of course. Let's go. We start with the harem. With the greatest of pleasure. Do you think you can find it? You must guide me. <laughs> it is you who must lead me. Straight on ahead there, across the hall. Mm. I'm Caleb. I beg of you. Don't disturb me. Go away. We must act quickly. Yes, but calmly. The first test went beautifully. Mm. Your eyeglass is looking different. But where is she? Over there, beyond the fountain. I'll go along. I'll wait here. Be prudent. to say to me. Well, I am only to speak an answer to your direct question. Isn't that what you ordered? Sure, of course. Sit down. Your voyage met with unforeseen events. So I was told. That sailor, Simbad. I heard that you spared his life. Why? I don't know. For pity, perhaps. I'm told that it assembled me. In a very impressive way. Your generosity was useless. A ship tucked in a boat with three corpses. No! Azem, I want to see a dance today. I am ready. Nor the music, nor the rehearsal. I said I am ready. All right, all right, as soon as possible. Certainly, why? Stupid! The bad one was left behind at the edge. It's a number 12, Lord. After you. I'll go in first. 
Come. Huh? Why close it? Because if someone passes and sees it closed, they won't suspect. Uh -huh. We have very little time. You cover that window. You go over there. Quick, a patrol can pass it in a moment. Oh, I've never seen this bottle. Certainly, it's unique. Careful, they're watching us. The guards! Oh, let's get out of here! Oh, Back in there, quickly! Oh, 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 oh. 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 This is the only way I can think of. You must be out of your mind. <laughs> Finally, no. Why, uh, the guards are coming back. I'll have you blinded. The Sultans, the Amers, and the people have decided to depose you now. The new Caliph of Persia is me. <laughs> if this is your idea of justice, Caliph Shariar, your reign has lasted too long. Uh, uh. 
Who are you? I'm your twin brother, Shariar. Keeping with the laws of the country, one of us had to disappear. But our father didn't want this and left evidence of my identity. First, there's only one throne. You know, I could have killed you more than once, but I don't want to kill you. I want only. No, Sinbad, you won't be the new caliph of Baghdad. Your dynasty will no longer rule over Persia because neither of you will survive. In the name of the army, I assume full power. You see, they forgot the rope. So when they left the room, the noble Asim and the noble Sarambin helped us to get out of the trap we'd fallen into. And Sharia, now how did he get away? Huh. Rather imprudent we were that night to leave him alone in the end, cause when he came to, he broke down the door and left. Then in the street he met Zanabi and... Yeah. <laughs> I understand. That's the story could go on. Simbad, why don't you send a message to Asim and Sarambed and charge them to rule as regents until we return? We will not return. Is that what you want? Yes, because now it is possible. I've been thinking about the girls in the harem. The Caliph's wife sent them all away. All of them. Oh, come on, think about something serious. Uh, remember that trap door? Yes. Uh, well, now, if we put planks on top of it... And then? We open the safe without falling into the trap below. Hmm? <laughs> 